and it has been so long since I've filmed a rewind spread so I thought I would film one today. I am very very backed up <laughs> like I haven't filmed one in so long that I'm actually this one is going to be for the last week of April so I don't know if you guys are interested in seeing these I will post this one if you really don't like that please comment down below and let me know but it's kind of nice to look back and see memories plus I have a bunch of kits and um, I don't want to save them for next year because I'm gonna just keep on getting <laughs> more and more kits right so the kit I want to use this week is a mini kit from Silver Antler Co that when she had her physical shop and it's called Strawberry Fields and it has nine beautiful full boxes there's a lot of strawberry themed things I mean it says strawberry fields the reason I'm using this is because the last week of April yes um, that's when we celebrated Easter because there was too many things going on and I wouldn't have had my girls and there was something happening with my mom that she wouldn't have been able to come so and I'm well me and my daughters we hosted Easter this year so we're probably gonna be doing it again this year um, yeah so these are the full boxes we have some date covers beautiful weekend banners some boxes date dots and some more functional stickers habit trackers I won't be using the habit trackers given that this is a rewind spread so and it also comes with these beautiful headers and uh, given that there is a lot of browns and things I'm thinking about maybe pulling in some things <laughs> actually one of the things I'd really really like to pull in is I'll ignore this I just keep my well most of my tapes in here from girl boss Anna and I want to use this because it's very simple and I like to keep it in this pouch from Simply Gilded. <laughs> so, and I'm most likely going to be pulling in things as I go. So if you'd like to keep on watching and see how this turns out, um, like I said, I'm thinking about pulling in, oh no, that's the rose gold. Oh, sorry. I have my little stash of minis here. And um, I was thinking, no, that's rose gold. Oh yeah, this is from this is from Jelly Washi. Uh, you've, I'm sure you've seen my hauls from that shop here. Comment down below if you have any idea what happened to her. Uh, the last that she posted in oh, that's the one I wanted. Um, the last that I saw her post was in early August. And when you click on the link for her shop, it's it no longer exists. So um, please comment down below if anyone knows what happened to her because I love her shop. And I mean, I could see that she was on her way to becoming as big as Simply Gilded just because her style is very pretty. And well, at least <laughs> I, I'm I was obsessed with her washi. The only one that I didn't get was the last one that she had was which was almost this color and it had lashes and little triangles, but like the, no, oh, can you see this? It's like a light beige, and that's what it was. That's what her, it looked more like a grayish color, sorry. But um, yeah, so if you know anything, please comment down below. But in the meantime, I'm thinking about pulling in these and uh, we'll go from there. So if you wanna see, just keep on watching and um, take it away, future me. <laughs> So this is basically um, me putting down <laughs> my date dots and I actually had quite a lot of fun skipping over Thursday. Of course I skipped it really quickly, see? <laughs> uh, I took it off 
really quickly that's what it's gonna look like but it was actually really really slow because I was so stressed out and I'm just gonna put down my date dots and uh, or <laughs> my date covers now and I think this kit is just so pretty okay so I'm starting my Monday with a sticker from Mochi Kichi that says morning because I had a nice relaxing sleep in morning <laughs> and I'm putting my full box down underneath that and I decided to use the lighter of the headers and the, um, in the kit because I thought it would give a nice pop of uh, light color and I'm using some header overlays with bows on them in gold and those are also from Silver Antlico. And I did some planning so I used the planning time sticker on top of some of the washi and underneath that I used a binge watch uh, sticker from Clover uh, Clover Prince Co. And uh, because I binge watched some plan with me's that day and now I'm just trimming the clear from the uh, the full box overlay that I used because it's uh, girl boss Anna's older um, model where it wasn't perforated and I was trying to write and it was really hard to write on top of the planner so <laughs> I just decided to take the answer it out so and now I'm readjusting things and oh, I didn't feel like taking my undo so I figured eh, I'll just add a strip of five millimeter washi from Simply Gilded and that'll be that. So now we're back in focus and nice and centered <laughs> and I'm gonna put down my bottom washi and I chose the part that has a bit of the pie but a bit of the plants as well. I didn't want to just do like food related. I wanted you know, I wanted to cut the, the pies a little bit. So I thought that worked out really well. And I'm using my um, my X-Acto knife from Michaels because it's pretty <laughs> and because it seems to be cutting. I do need some new blades though. My, um, what's it called? My slice tool is just, eh, it's been kind of meh lately, so. And now I want to use that overlay tape from Girl Boss Anna because I have the matching bottom washi that matches with those roses it's just that it would have been way too many roses and on a really patterned bottom washi like that it would have looked horrible so I just decided to add a little pop of sil uh, silver <laughs> of gold foil at the bottom with the um, with the thinner overlay and I think it turned out really really pretty what do you guys think? So now I'm just slicing that and I'm gonna be coming on to Tuesday. And I think, oh, now I figure that I better move things around because I think, uh, no, I wanted to disperse the order that I put things just because it looked all squished and everything. Now that I have the, the bottom washi down, it just looked kind of weird. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing and uh, having so much fun. Maybe I should have cut that part out. <laughs> and yeah, some of the undo um, kind of smeared when it had the um, some of the ink on there. And uh, yeah, I had already started. Thank goodness I didn't do the whole voiceover, but I did start doing the voiceover on this part of my plan with me. And for some reason it didn't record so hopefully uh, this will not be a problem and yeah you can tell that I recorded this a little later because my nails are not colored at that point I did film like the first part and then I think it was like the next day or something that I did um, like the the part that I was just gonna be planning without um, without talking and <laughs> just doing the voiceover and now I'm checking things and I'm looking at things and I, I don't remember what that purple reflection is from. I don't know if it was my glass of water or what, but if we figure it out, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, I picked that from a Sweet Gwaii design uh, book that I got at Michael's. 
and I think it was like some of the first ones that came out. I don't know if they're still in stores. I haven't been to a Michael's looking in those areas like in a while and, and not my usual one anyway. So uh, I slept in, so I thought coffee cup kind of, you know, kind of works for that. And then I'm going to use, uh, I don't remember what order I did this, but um, yeah, because I ended up, like in truth, I really did just put a, okay, so I put this clean to clean sticker and that was from, I forget now. Oh, um, we saw it and now I forget. And I decided to use the vacuum cleaner one from San Cute Little Art. And I really, really like her, her character stickers. They're so cute. And then what did I, what did I do? I'm actually gonna switch. Oh yeah, so I used the three heart checkbox and uh, I'm writing down that I tidied up the living room, uh, the dining room, and I organized the plastic containers in my kitchen because it was a huge, huge mess. Couldn't find anything and now it actually, it's, I've had it for a couple of weeks now. Uh, no, not that, but I've actually, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> okay. I did organize it then and then that didn't work out at all because I was putting the containers with the lids and then anyway it was just oh all kinds of bad so I decided to um, to use another uh, organizing idea that I got from I think it was um, do it on a dime uh, she's a YouTuber and uh, she gives some really, really great ideas on how to do that kind of stuff and uh, how to do like uh, cheap DIYs and uh, she's a huge fan of the Dollar Tree and the dollar stores and uh, and yeah, so and I've had, her, I've been using her method for, um, yeah, must at least be a month by now and uh, it actually works <laughs> so far so good everything's like staying neat and it's a lot easier to put away and all that so I <laughs> cross my fingers it's gonna stay that way so you'll notice that things are gonna move around because I realized that I had uh, well I received some mail from uh, Clover Prince Co at that time she was still HMZ designs so I wrote HMZ designs you know but I received an order from her and um, I also did some shopping and had ordered some Silver Antler Co and some So Cute Planner stickers from um, on that day as well and I wanted to mark them down but then I wouldn't have had any any room so you'll see me move everything around at some point and yeah I was having a bit of a hard time here trying to get everything to cut like the the blade just I guess it's really getting dull. I need to get some more. So, and I also noticed, okay, so now I'm filling that in, that quarter box that has the to clean will actually switch to a header. Um, pretty sure it's from the kit. And now, there you go. Okay, so now I figure that if I, I really, really wanted to use these wonton in a million stickers, you know to say that because I love using them in memory spreads and there you go so I used a header for from the kit a to clean script I will link the shop down below I just cannot seem to remember it's um <sighs> she has a printable shop anyway and then I did all that and then that beautiful Mickey or mini looking bow is from um, Clover Prince Co. Uh, I don't think she has those anymore, but uh, if you're looking for something like that, you can just, you know, uh, give her a shout on Instagram and uh, see what happens. Or you can leave a comment down below and um, she watches all of my videos 
religiously. So, <laughs> so even the ones that are not, you know, featuring her shop or anything. So, um, yeah, she might answer you or I'll answer you or whatever. <laughs> so, and yeah, I decided to add a pop of red. I realized I had these orchid colored blanket planner vinyl headers and I thought oh this is just perfect and I and then it popped in my head that that's exactly why I was so happy to have them when I got this kit because I wanted to use them together so if you notice I moved things over oh my gosh okay do you see how I switched that five millimeter washi on Monday for one of those headers and do you also see how crooked it is like it is so hella crooked. Oh my gosh. So bad. <laughs> I'm trying to straighten it now because it's just, it's driving me nuts. Why? Pourquoi? <laughs> okay, well, it's straightened my planner now. I bet you won't be able to unsee that. So I used a, <laughs> I used a payday script on top of a um, flag from the kit. And the payday script is from Clover Prince Co. And uh, as well as those uh, film and edit scripts. And I did film my last Simply Spoilers because I stopped my Simply Gilded um, subscription. It was just getting to be a, quite a lot. And um, also, I also haven't purchased another mystery kit from Simply Beautiful Plans, and I feel so bad because I love her mystery kits, but I'm just, it was just getting to be like quite a lot and, you know, like making sure that I encouraged the shops that I was uh, PRing for and, you know, like, you know how it is, you know. Okay, so this is when I realized, oh crap, I'm putting a double line and now I have two full boxes that have just the one line and then anyway, so I'm going to swap those and, um, you know, to make it like to alternate them. So hopefully, yeah, no, because there was some dark ink, it wouldn't work. So I ended up having to get some fresh ones and I switched them and they look so pretty. So now we're all caught up and I put a grocery, um, grocery shopping. Yeah. Sticker from San Cute Little Art and, uh, some gaming, <laughs> some gaming girls from, um, who was that again? <laughs> from Birch Tree something. Oh my gosh. She's going to be down below. She's amazing. Um, she actually sent me those stickers because she wanted me to try them out. And because we were all three of us, uh, me and my daughters, we were in the living room, just all on our phones. And we realized we were all playing games <laughs> because we could hear each other's games. And then we kind of compare notes on what we were doing on games. Anyway, it was, yeah, it was lame, but <laughs> it was a fun night because so, we'd still chat and, you know, it was pretty fun. So, uh, <laughs> and then, yeah, so I'm doing the trick where I'm putting the, um, my header at the bottom of my full box and, uh, yeah, but because I did that, no, I think I'm going to end up switching them. Yeah. That's when I'm like, no, I really don't like that for some reason. Some of them I'm okay when I do that, but this one, for some reason, I just did not like it. So I went ahead and put it on top and I just could not get it to be even like could not do it. So this is what was the best I was able to do. And so that just means that my full box looks shorter now because I didn't want to take it off and whatever. So, um, yeah, so I did that. And now I'm going to add a half box, which I realize is way too big compared to the work script that I found from, she's from a European shop. And I really hated the way I work. I wrote the word work. So I'm looking through my things and oh my gosh, I just found out. Yeah, see, there it is. And it's a AHP. That's the... Um, and I cannot remember what that stands for, but I will have them all down 
uh, in the description box. But did you see that, or did you find out that Tassel Planner is closing her shop? I am dying a little bit inside now because I was so looking forward to placing an order, but I, I can't place an order until maybe the end of the month or maybe next month, but then it's going to be too late by then. So, um, yeah, the little, uh, clip is from Simply Beautiful Plants because I had my reports that were due for, um, my volunteer work and, um, uh, yeah, that bow is still the same one from Clover Prince Co. And I filled up the car and I used a car sticker with a heart from Tassel Planner. And underneath that, I'm going to put, I'm going to use one of the big strips of, oh no, I'm actually going to use, I thought it was a big strip, but it's actually two strips that match, but that go together. So uh, two strips of the washi from the kit. And I'm going to put an exhausted Tinta from, um, from that shop. Oh my gosh, where is my memory? No idea. No idea, guys. I'm really sorry, but I don't know where my brain is tonight. So, uh, Tinta, Tinta. It's going to come back to me. And now I'm using the cute little mailbox from Simply Beautiful Plants. It was from an old uh, sales uh, freebie and I was done the freebie. So I was really happy that I was able to use that. And I don't know, there was something sticky kind of on my desk and I cleaned it off afterwards. So yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so I decided to just adjust that and the, um, the overlay and try to trim it as much as possible. So, yeah. Now, I really don't... Oh, yeah, I was trying to put it over and it just looked kind of wonky. So I do trim one, the top line so that it doesn't look stupid. So, yeah, see? And uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, see, I know you guys are all, like, a lot of you are team, hey, I love it when I finish a sticker sheet, but I'm not. I usually panic, but not when it comes to a sampler. When it's a sampler or a freebie, I'm always like, yay, I finished the freebie. So I guess I, I understand where you guys are coming from. Now, on Friday morning, I was still feeling wiped from work. Um, I was still on some old meds, and they were just kicking my butt all the time. So, um, yeah, so <laughs> what's kind of funny is that I used a Tinta, another Tinta, but this one says done for the day, and I literally put that at the top. <laughs> so it's like, you know, it, it's the first thing in the morning. <laughs> so pretty funny. And uh, what else do we have? Underneath that, I'm going to add another one of those, um, what are they called? Um, another one of those vinyl headers right underneath because I'm trying to bring in more of that beautiful red. It is so gorgeous. I mean, and it's in the color orchid. They're so, so, so pretty. And uh, yeah, I'm trying to pull in some stickers and I just had to use those are some of my favorite I love stickers <laughs> stickers from um, um, parasol paper I absolutely love them she's you know she's all dolled up and she's covering stickers and it's just yeah <laughs> so and then I'm like oh that's right it's in gold foil so I used a ton of those little hearts from the wonton in a million book same uh, sticker book that I used on Tuesday and uh, yeah I didn't tell you guys that I used that I used the one one of the I don't know what they're called but one of the wontons I guess um, on Tuesday holding the stickers and that's because I'd received uh, an order from HMZ Designs and when I went shopping then I used another one of those stickers um, on underneath that's pushing a, a cart so yeah I just realized there was six headers so uh, I would have to skip one of those days but that's okay and 
that pie one looks so dang amazing. I wish I could bake because I'd probably make some pie. <laughs> yeah. All right. So yeah, decided to trim them in advance now so that they would not be so um, time consuming, except that, yep, you just saw me do that. I was terrified that I pulled the foil, but I actually didn't, so yay me. <laughs> and underneath that, I literally just did some YouTube binge, which is, you know, that's my life. Um, so I used a strip, uh, a strip, a strip of the washi and I put a TV from Prairie Planner, Planner, Prairie, something. It's something Prairie and you probably saw it. I totally missed the name and now I can't back up because if I do, then my voiceover is going to be all messed up. So, um, she'll be, you know she'll be down below so I decided to use the wine bottle full uh yeah full box on Saturday just because that's the day that we did the cleaning and we started doing the um what's it called like the prep for the next day <laughs> because the next day the Sunday that was the day that we did our um Easter 2.0 if you will <laughs> so um, okay, sorry, I'm moving around here because I'm trying to get comfortable. I'm all curled up in my chair. And, uh, yeah, so I cleaned the whole kitchen because it really needed a good, nice, good scrub. And the girls helped me cleaning, so I used... So basically, I used two, two stickers from uh, San Cute Little Art. And then I used some of those gold foiled uh, hearts again. And I, yeah, so now I learned my lesson. I didn't want to cut another or trim like another full box. So I just, I just said, I'm going to use the, the space I have. The only thing I'm really sad is I didn't use the two, um, the two full boxes that were like a whole scene, but I'm thinking of saving it for another spread or something because it does have some red, but it's not... I don't know, I think it could match in other spreads, so we'll see. And now I'm putting my overlay, and I actually got that on the first try, all right. I'm so great, and wow, yeah, it looks like I've got something gummy on my desk, and I really should have cleaned that before, but you know, I was in a hurry, wasn't thinking, I started filming, and then I noticed. <laughs> That's usually how things work in my brain. And then I used a half box, and uh, I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to put on there. And I'm going to end up putting a dinner time sticker from Mochikichi. And underneath that, I'm going to write Great Late Easter Day. And I'm also going to pull in another sticker from Wonton in a Million that's got like the hearts coming out and is really happy because my mommy was so happy. She uh, didn't get to, she didn't have to cook, she didn't have to do anything, and uh, she was totally relaxed so she was very very happy about that and uh yeah at first I was gonna put a heart but then I'm like nah then I spotted that one I'm like nope that's the one I want <laughs> and yeah I know I didn't put it in the right spot but hey it's my sticker book so this is how it turned out. I absolutely, absolutely love it. It's so cute. It's so pretty. And I love the red. It's just awesome. So thank you so, so, so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll chat with you later.